In mathematics, specifically in topology, the interior of a subset S of points of a topological space X consists of all points of S that do not belong to the boundary of S. A point that is in the interior of S is an interior point of S. The interior of S is the complement of the closure of the complement of S. In this sense interior and closure are dual notions. The exterior of a set is the interior of its complement, equivalently the complement of its closure, it consists of the points that are in neither the set nor its boundary. The interior, boundary, and exterior of a subset together partition the whole space into three blocks or fewer when one or more of these is empty. The interior and exterior are always open while the boundary is always closed. Sets with empty interior have been called boundary sets. Definitions Topic interior point If S is a subset of a Euclidean space, then X is an interior point of S if there exists an open ball centered at X which is completely contained in S this is illustrated in the introductory section to this article. This definition generalizes to any subset S of a metric space X with metric D. X is an interior point of S if there exists R greater than zero, such that Y is in S whenever the distance D X, Y. This definition generalizes to topological spaces by replacing open ball with open set. Let S be a subset of a topological space X then X is an interior point of S if X is contained in an open subset of X which is completely contained in S equivalently, X is an interior point of S if S is a neighborhood of X. <laughs> interior of a set The interior of a set S is the set of all interior points of S. The interior of S is denoted int S, int S, or so. The interior of a set has the following properties. Int S is an open subset of S. Int S is the union of all open sets contained in S. Int S is the largest open set contained in S. A set S is open if and only if S equals int S. Int int S equals int S idempotence. If S is a subset of T, then int S is a subset of int T. If A is an open set, then A is a subset of S if and only if A is a subset of int S. Sometimes the second or third property above is taken as the definition of the topological interior. Note that these properties are also satisfied if interior subset union contained in largest and open are replaced by closure, superset, intersection, which contains smallest and closed, respectively. For more on this matter, see interior operator below. Topic examples In any space, the interior of the empty set is the empty set. In any space X, if a X display style A subset X, then int A is contained in A. If X is the Euclidean space R display style math B R of real numbers, then int 0, 1 equals 0, 1. If X is the Euclidean space R display style math B R, then the interior of the set Q display style math B Q of rational numbers is empty. 
if x is the complex plane C equals R2, display style math b C equals math b R caret 2, then I N T Z element of C Z 1 equals Z element of C Z 1, display style mathrm int Z in math b C Z L E Q 1 equals Z in math b C Z in any Euclidean space, the interior of any finite set is the empty set. On the set of real numbers, one can put other topologies rather than the standard one. If x equals r displaystyle x equals math b r where r Display style math b r has the lower limit topology, then int zero one equals zero one. If one considers on r display style math b r the topology in which every set is open, then int zero one equals zero one. If one considers on R display style math b r the topology in which the only open sets are the empty set and R display style math b r itself then int 0 1 is the empty set these examples show that the interior of a set depends upon the topology of the underlying space the last two examples are special cases of the following. In any discrete space, since every set is open, every set is equal to its interior. In any indiscrete space X, since the only open sets are the empty set and X itself, we have int X equals X and for every proper subset O of X, int A is the empty set equals topic interior operator equals the interior operator o is dual to the closure operator in the sense that s equals x x s Display style s caret circ equals x backslash overline x backslash s, and also s equals x x s. Display style bar s equals x backslash x backslash s caret circ where x is the topological space containing s, and the backslash refers to the set theoretic difference. Therefore, the abstract theory of closure operators and the Kuratowski closure axioms can be easily translated into the language of interior operators, by replacing sets with their complements. Exterior of a set The exterior of a subset S of a topological space X, denoted X S or X S, is the interior int X S of its relative complement. Alternatively, it can be defined as X S. The complement of the closure of S many properties follow in a straightforward way from those of the interior operator, such as the following. X S is an open set that is disjoint with S. X S is the union of all open sets that are disjoint with S. X S is the largest open set that is disjoint with S. 
If S is a subset of T, then X t S is a superset of X t T. Unlike the interior operator, X t is not idempotent, but the following holds. X t X t S is a superset of int S. Topic: Interior disjoint shapes. Two shapes A and B are called interior disjoint if the intersection of their interiors is empty. Interior disjoint shapes may or may not intersect in their boundary. Topic. See also Algebraic interior Interior algebra Jordan curve theorem Quasi-relative interior Relative interior